Hi, today's video regarding HP DexJet 2700 series printer and I'm going to show you how to do the copy print and scan using this printer. So the first I'll do the copy and then we will do the wireless scanning and printing using printers inbuilt Wi-Fi system. Now the first step is to switch on the printer. So press the power button on. Also load the pages in the rear tray. Now take the output tray out and just wait for the printer to work and to do the copy we need to open the top scanner, place a page facing downwards on the right hand corner and close the lid. Now we need to do the copy so we go on the control panel. So we have two options to do color or black and white. So first we'll do color. So click it once. So the more the number of times you click it, it will print more copies. So you can see it's quick and it's fast in doing the copy. Now the second thing is to do the wireless scanning and wireless printing. Now to do that we need to activate the printer's Wi-Fi direct system and we need to connect it with our smartphone. Now go on the display screen and see if the Wi-Fi direct is off or on. So Wi-Fi direct icon is available here so we cannot see that means it's off. So we need to press the wi wireless button blue button once and once this wireless button is off it will activate the Wi-Fi direct as you can see this little icon above the tricoloring cartridge icon so that is for the Wi-Fi direct now press information button once it will print a page you will see a printer information page here and in this page you will see the Wi-Fi direct password so you will see the printer has printed a printer information page it displays the name of the printer and you have to look for the Wi-Fi direct icon here it says the Wi-Fi direct name of the printer and also says the Wi-Fi direct password here now take your smartphone like iPhone or Android phone and download the HP smart app from the App Store now open the Wi-Fi setting of your device and look for the printer's name here that is direct AAHP DexJet 2700 series so click on that and it will ask the password now enter the password as it was shown on the page here click on the connect button you will see it is connected and it also says there is no internet because this is the printers inbuilt Wi-Fi system now keep this connection don't switch it back and open the HP smart app now we have to add the printer here so we just simply need to click on the plus button on the top of the screen and it will display the name of the printer again that is HP DexJet 2700 series printer and you have to click on that it will add up automatically it also displays the amount of ink left in the both ink cartridges and all the details are available here about the printer if you click on it it will show you the status of the printer and some other details of it now go back and to do the wireless scanning as you can see here there is an option like printer scan so we click on that now open the top scanner and place a page facing downwards like this and close the lid now click on the scan button so you can hear the sound here like it has started to scan so it will scan it and it will transfer it automatically here now we can do the multiple scannings with this printer and we can save it as a single document also to do that we need to click on the plus button here now open the top scanner lid 
and place a page you want to add and click on the scan button again so this way we can do multiple scannings and we can save it in a single file so once it is done we are able to save it so I'll show you those things as well so here you can see both pages are available once you are ready to use it you can click on the save button and here you can select if you want a JPEG or PDF you can also change the name of the file and click on the save button once it is saved we go back and now I'll show you how to do the wireless printing to do that you can select any document from this app like print document section now all your PDFs will be available here or your photos will be available here and scanned files even if you want to print the scanned files you can do that as you now I'm going to show you how to print a PDF now select it and click on the print button you get two options here like if you want more copies or if you want any page range and once it is done you can confirm and click on the print icon and just wait for the printer now the command is sent and it has started to print so overall I can say this is a very good printer for the wireless printing and scanning it's very quick to set up hopefully you enjoyed the video and you liked how to do copy print and scan with this printer thanks for watching